What's going on guys? Nessa here and this is I guess a little bit of an update video. So today is the day after Labor Day and it is a very busy morning for me because I'm calling around to see how much car parts are. So basically what I'm looking for is a decent set of coilovers and well for a decent price as well. And I am looking for a drop in air filter for now. I was looking for aftermarket sensors but then it's, I'm just going to leave the whole TPMS light. It's going to come off during the winter anyways because I'm going to throw on back my original wheels and tires so it's fine. It's, I'm tired of that but anyway so back to the task at hand. So I don't know man I don't know I don't know because I could buy Canon filters here believe it or not. I mean then again why wouldn't you? But the problem is, if I were to go to a shop, like say Too Fast, it might be somehow che more cheaper or better to buy it from say Too Fast because I get a better deal out of it. Although I do work here, it's not really much of a discount anymore. So at this point, I'm just trying to weigh out my options. If I were to go to Too Fast in North York. All right guys, update. So I finally called Too Fast. Um, they gave me the price of 90 bucks, but between getting it here and getting it there, I might actually get a better deal out of buying it from Too Fast. So I'm just going to go with Too Fast. While I did call them, I did ask about just pricing for coilovers for a specific case for it. Um, what do you call it? Um, model and all that stuff. Sorry guys, I keep getting um, distracted by other people, but it's all good, so. All right, so basically what I was saying, license plate light is out, okay, cool. Um, so basically, I ordered from Too Fast. They're supposed to get back to me on the coils. I'm just looking for pricing. I'm not looking to buy. All right, calm down. That's why I don't like Jeep Cherokees, because they seem odd to operate, so. Get back to me with pricing. I just want to know how much it would be and how much my damage would be. If I were to get coils, I'd probably get it from them. Um, I don't know if I'm going to install it myself or I'm just going to have them install it. So, then again, I'm going to be honest though. I mean, the last time I went there to go and get my... that angled? No, of course not. Yeah, so the last time I went to go and get my rims done, ugh, somebody was doing their coilovers, and yeah, it didn't really work out that way, because as soon as they dropped it down, and the guy rode around in it for a little bit, it started to squeak, and I'm like, yeah, I kind of don't want it to squeak, you know? So, is a parking brake up? Let's try not to kill this guy, so let me angle myself. Awesome. Anyway, yeah, so... I mean, not that they're not credible by any way, shape, or form, but after seeing that, it kind of makes you a little iffy on it, you feel me? So, I don't know, we'll see, though. Um, I would really like to install it myself, but... This is just a quick little video, I mean, it's, it's a lot longer for me to record this than for you to guys to actually watch it, because everything is happening but i hope you guys enjoyed this video please hit the like button please comment share and subscribe for more take care <laughs> i find it so funny though when i haven't been there in like maybe it was back in i think it was back in july because that's when i went for my court day for my speeding ticket so it's been it's been like about a month or so since i've last been there and um called them Called too fast, I should say, and <laughs> I love how they immediately recognized me. <laughs> so then I called them, like, hey, what's going on? And they're like, oh, shoot, the girl with the black CRV that threw on the Rams and the um, vibrant stuff. I'm like, yeah, man, that's me. And they're like, how you doing? Blah, blah, blah. And I told them I'm good. Um, I'm looking for parts, so <laughs> that's about it. But it's nice. I mean, I feel like the only reason why I'm known or I guess easier to remember because I'm the crazy chick that wants to modify a CRV. Like, how any other person would modify, say, like a Beamer or like a muscle cars, especially um, KDM, 
JDM kind of cars and all that stuff. And here I am with my CRV, and it's like, yeah, I'm throwing on coils, um, throwing on a muffler. I'm thinking of doing a two step in the future because who wouldn't want to see a fire breathing warrior princess? You feel me? But everyone's just looking at me like, so why don't you just put all of that money that you have invested in your car? into your Mustang that you've been wanting. But it's like, of course I still have money for the Mustang. This is the whole matter of trying to find a house because apparently it's impossible in the GTA, but we're not talking about that today. But um, it's why not, you know? Adam boosted. He got a 97 CRV. He changed his stance a little bit. He raised it, so he lifted it. Throwing a two-step. And he was the baddest CRV in, I guess, in Southern Ontario, you know, before the engine blew up. But it's just, it's the unconventional. I like to do the unconventional. Like, who wants to be known as a person that, the 15 billionth person that modified a, say, a Mustang, right? Charger, Challenger, whatever the 335 or the 430 or something like that. I don't want to be known as another per the other sorry the millionth person who did that. I want to be known as that. I'd rather be known as a crazy chick that's modifying her CRV and it's like, yo, you have 200 and was it 30, 30 what? Am I 34 or 35? 35 now. Thousand clicks on her and like she's gonna die soon and blah blah blah. But it's like, dude, it's a Honda. Honda. At the end of the day, it's a Honda. Hondas, even when you don't maintain them, they don't die. So, like, what's that say about the rest of the car brands? Except for, like, or not Lexus, but what's the other one? Um, Toyota. But otherwise, it's just like, at the end of the day, I'm only putting parts that I can transfer on to another vehicle. So... Not so much for the coils, but the rest of the other things that I put on, like the rims and the muffler, like that's about all that I'm really going to do at the most. And I don't need more than that. My mom, she wants to get the new CRV. So if anything, for some reason, knock on wood, Warrior Princess is no more. I just transfer it from one to the next. You feel me? So. I just do it for fun, man. Like, I mean, at the end of the day, it's not your—it's not your money. It's mine. I'm wait. If I want to waste it, let me waste it. You feel me? So, it is what it is. But again, I should probably end off this video because I already ended it, and here I am still talking and shit. So, I don't know. <laughs> Anyways, later, guys.